Hello everyone. I decided to come over here and show y'all a few of my items that I got from TJ Maxx. And first of all, y'all, today has been a long day. I'm going to do this video as quick as I can and get done. <laughs> my makeup looks terrible. My contour none, none disappeared. My lashes on this side is like hanging down. This one is still looking good. Um, my makeup is sweaty. Um, yeah, y'all, I used the um, ELF foundation. Um, yeah, I used it, and my skin is an oily mess, okay? Um, however, it's at the end of the day. I had to do what I had to do today. It's been a long day. Then I did a little extra. Y'all, I'm exhausted. So, don't judge me. I decided to come in here and create this video because, you know, some of y'all been missing some videos and stuff. I told y'all I'm not creating videos anymore. Not for a while, okay? I don't know when I'm going to be creating uh, if I decide to keep creating videos over here on YouTube. But I will show y'all these because I got some fantastic products here, okay? And I got some from Walmart and TJ Maxx, okay? So I'm very excited about the TJ Maxx because... Y'all know how much I love eyeshadows. I found some good, inexpensive eyeshadow palettes. Um, I'm excited. And then I found one product from, uh, uh, what is it? Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um, let me get with it. Let me, let me just show you. Um, so this is what I found by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Is this uh, loose highlighter. It's loose highlighter, and it's like, how many? One, two, three. I guess it's just three of them. Yes, it's three highlighters. Y'all, I thought that was glitter and highlighter. I thought it was more than three products, but it's only three products in here. But it's very, very pretty. As you can see, you got the, the light silver shade, then you got a golden shade, and then you got a pink bronzy shade. So these are highlighters, but you know you can use highlighters as eyeshadows. Um, currently, I've been using a product that I just got from Amazon, and I love it. I got those products on my eyes, and I love it for a natural eye makeup look. Like, this is probably more natural than any of my natural eye makeup looks that I've created. But anyways, uh, these are the products from this, and this was $7.99, y'all. For three of Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, loose highlighters. Okay. Came in this nice package. Really, really like that. Okay. Then I got this uh, Absolute New York. Y'all know how I got a lot of Absolute New York products. Uh, this is the Absolute New York Brow Wax. It says Maximum Hold. I used the Eel Lift today, um, the Brow Lift, and I love it, okay? My brows is looking amazing, and you can see my brow hairs as well. I love that. However, this brow is a little bit lighter than the other one. I told you I've been sweating up a storm with this foundation, and plus the weather outside. But anyways, I got this brow wax because I thought it would be good. I love the brand Absolute New York, so I thought, why not try this as well? Because I'm into the brow wax stuff. It really does make a difference with the brows. It makes my brows look thicker and longer and fuller, so I don't seem to have a problem no more with, you know, having a draw on my brows anymore. I like the fact that they now can look natural by using a brow wax. Or brow gel. So, yeah. Got that product from TJ Maxx. And here's a product that I got from TJ Maxx. This is the Violet Voss Eye Pinky Promise. <laughs> um, 
y'all but look at the shadows this is going to be perfect for i've got some i've already sanitized my products y'all i sanitize everything but this is going to be great for the autumn fall time not autumn but fall time winter time uh it's plum shades but it's also got those warm shades and just the perfect highlighters if y'all can see those real good you probably can't because a lot of times you can't but anyways i got a fabulous palette right here and you can tell that the colors are very very pigmented so i can't wait to use this product then by makeup Revol revolution i got this palette right here this is the blush palette the new neutral blush palette i got this one it was like four dollars and fifty cents and so let me show you what this looks like let me take off the cover here this plastic cover i don't care for those things um this is what the colors look like you've got some um bright tones you got some fall time tones and you got some amazing um shimmers and a glitter right here so i thought this would be nice during the holiday time create some makeup looks and y'all remember i've sanitized my products i do that so if you see that that looks like water that's just me sanitizing my eyeshadows and things so um yeah so this is the palette i know you can't see it real good maybe you can but this is what it looks like very nice palette like that i like makeup revolution some people don't like them but uh every once in a while i get a hope to a makeup revolution like product i love it i love that product and that was that was four dollars and fifty cents and that pinky promise was like $5.99 what a deal all right so now i got this is it zoeva zoeva yeah zoeva i think zoeva yeah this is the together we grow eyeshadow palette together we grow when i seen this i thought about i'm growing more and more with the lord okay um just so much so much is going on a lot of great blessings y'all what more can i say i know some of y'all say this is an eyeshadow palette but together we grow i kind of wanted this palette because i was like you know what i'm growing closer and closer and getting a greater and better relationship with the lord okay so it's amazing so i just got this and when i open this palette up these are all cool tones but look at the colors in this palette look at that they're cool tones but they are really nice tones some of these tones are actually in the um i forget what palette it is it's one of those popular palettes that everybody's talking about um but a lot of these tones remind me of some of those tones that's in that palette that's really popular and trending um so i just love the shimmers i love all these matte tones uh you can cre create a natural eyeshadow look as well as a bolder eyeshadow look it just depends on you but anyways you guys i got this palette and i think this one was 6.99 might have been four i think it was 5.99 but anyways it was either 5.99 or 6.99 so i got this one it's really pretty then i got two of these um one store here in town sells this brand all the time um, I don't know if y'all heard of Burke's Outlet. Do y'all remember when I used to have all those hauls? When I was doing makeup videos, I used to buy a lot of Burke's Outlet products. Well, they had a couple or a few uh, products from this brand. And it is, um, this is the Rosy Nudes Eyeshadow Palette. And so this is what it looks like. This is very pretty. Uh, this has the most amazing everyday 
type of shades and tones uh, for natural eyeshadow looks. So, then you got that, you know, some tones that's a little bit more bolder, like this orange-red tone. I can't wait to try that. And the rest of them is like bronzy, shimmery type of tones. It's just so pretty. Y'all, I just can't wait to try it. That is beautiful. And I think this palette was $5.99, y'all. And then this is from the same brand. This is the Rosy Nudes. And this one is similar. You can tell it's the same brand. But this one has the more, more like plum tones. So it's going to be perfect for the fall and winter time. So I got this palette right here. It is so pretty. Then you got some natural tones in there too. I'm all about natural makeup looks on an everyday basis. Now I might put a little bit more. Like today I put a little bit more because... I went to a place that, you know, it has TJ Maxx, a lot of stores. So, I put on a little extra on my cheeks. A little bit more foundation than I normally do. Because <laughs> usually I just use my Dermatology Universal Tinted Moisturizer. <sighs> y'all think something was in my teeth. If it was, y'all overlook it. Because I'm going to the dentist, okay? I forgot to do that. That was one thing that I was supposed to do today. But anyways, y'all. Um, yeah, I just ate um, a few minutes ago. But anyway, uh, that's the Rosy News palette. And this one is vegan and cruelty free. So, yeah. Very nice palettes. That's all the eyeshadow palettes. And that's everything from TJ Maxx. Now I have one, well, two products from Dollar General. I love these lipsticks. I'm almost thinking about going back off to a few others and see if they have any more because these are a dollar piece. The nude lipstick that I got on, I know I got liner on, but you can tell I got this shiny nude, perfect nude shade here. Y'all, it's a plumper. And it stays on really, really well. So, because I found out last night that was a dollar, I went back to the same store. And they had the same shade, which is called Nude Lux. That's what I have on. Now, I have liner on, okay? Lip liner. But this is the shade. It's so pretty. Without liner, if you want it to look real natural, don't do liner. But if you want to intensify it, Put liner on, but y'all, I got a backup of this. So excited. And then I got this shade right here that's called Turn Heads. And this one is like a coral, like a corally brown tone. Yeah. So it's very pretty. But this one seems to have a little glitter in it. So I'm excited to try this one. I feel like this is going to be a pretty autumn, not autumn, but fall time uh, lipstick or whatever, lip gloss shade. This is a lip plumper, y'all. And it's by LA Colors. I forgot to tell y'all that. So, got those right there from Dollar General. And then now, Walmart, I got a couple items, not much. So I got this Ilelf Lock-On Liner and Brow Cream. This is in the shade Espresso, I believe. They didn't have, no, it's in light brown. Oh my goodness. I think I already got that. All of the black was out. And then the next one was Espresso. And I thought this was Espresso. Y'all believe I got the same item that I already got. I got to take this back. If so. Um, it looks different to me. I can't open it up. Because if you open it up, you can't return it. I already got like this. No, I got taupe. I think I got taupe. No, this is different. Okay, so this is going to look like espresso. It says espresso, but underneath it says light light brown but anyways y'all i got it for my brows and also i got it to line my lash line when i want 
a soft liner or soft wing or whatnot. And so I got this. And then I got this right here, the LA Colors Gel Eyeliner. Uh, this is a um, liner by LA Colors. I think I said that. I decided to get another liner. I don't never get enough of liners now, just like mascaras. I'm about ready to. Nope, I'm not about ready because so far, this right here, this mascara is really good. I will not switch it up. I got that from Amazon and it is amazing. So, yeah, you guys, I mean, I got this one in case I'm, you know, as far as a liner, just to have a backup liner or whatnot. And then, uh, yesterday, I got a pair of Halloween lashes. That's what I have on right now. If y'all watch my videos back in the day, um, when it was, whenever it was Halloween time, I didn't create, like, Halloween, like, makeup looks or anything. But what I did love to get is those Halloween lashes, like the false lashes. Um... To me, a lot of those lashes are really, really pretty. They have different designs and all that. Some are really bold, and then some are some are, can be soft, and then some can be spiky. Just different designs, and I like lashes when they when it's uh, what is it October when it's October uh, the month of October comes around and it's uh, like almost time for Halloween. I like those lashes. So a lot of times. After Halloween, if they have any available, you know, they mark them down. And I try to go and get as many as I can. Because let me tell you, some of those lashes, some of those lashes you can wear on a regular basis. It doesn't have to be just for Halloween time. Okay, so um, some of them like this pair. This doesn't look like Halloween lashes. I know this one is messed up, y'all. I told y'all I had a long day. This one is like, yeah, it's messed up on the corner. But trust me, it looked like this this morning. And see how natural this is? I love these lashes on me, like with my eye shape. I think it looks really good. And also with me having a little, um, I have hooded lids with a little excess skin. So I feel like these lashes is just right for every day. If I wanted to put on a pair of lashes, and even if I got fixed up, this would be nice. Because honestly, I had, I've had i had them on since early this morning, okay? And they haven't made my eyes feel heavy. That's a lot. That's what I have to deal with most of the time is just my lashes feeling heavy sometimes. That happened after the injury. I used to never have that problem, but for some reason, I think it's all the, the, the excess skin on my eyelids. But anyways, you guys, um, these are so pretty. As you can see over here on this side, these lashes are just really nice and natural. And if you really didn't say nothing, most people would think this is my natural lashes. So, because I like them so much, I went back and got the last three pairs. <laughs> no, there's some more. I'm sorry. They had more than three pairs. I say that they got probably, this is the most popular one. I think a lot of women realize you can wear these every day, not just for Halloween. Like, these are really pretty. I think there probably is about 10 to 12 more pairs and i would have got all of them but i had already bought those palettes and stuff so at least i got three packs these were three dollars and something a piece these are the they call them now this is supposed to be for halloween it says kiss scary clown um i chew la lashes yeah they look like this that's what i have on right now these are so cute. I got three extra pairs. So I got one pair right here. So that makes four pairs. So I got some for a while. Because I can wear these a few times, as y'all know. So I have some for a little while. So I really like this. I hope I can find a pair of lashes that look like this. I'm pretty sure I can. Um on different sites or whatnot, maybe I can find the same lash because this is like the perfect lash for my eyelashes. Where you know, so you know, 
my lashes can't have nothing heavy on it. So yeah, you guys, that is it. That's all the products that I got today. However, I did get this liner here by Believe Beauty. This is the metallic liquid eyeliner. It's called Midnight in Paris. I really like this. I have it on right now. It's really natural. It's like a, it's like a very soft um, shade. So it looks really, really natural. I did put this on. And I have it right here in the corner side here. As you can see, I mean, it's not real neat now. It's over in the evening. But this is really, really good. I want to get more of these liners because they have different shades at the Dollar General. So these are very, very, this is a very good product. Um, like it because I looked at it today and it didn't really mess up too much. Okay, stay put. Um, yeah. So, because I put it on very soft. And then, y'all, I got this beauty blender that's like 97 cents at Walmart. This is so good. You've got this side here where you, I think you actually put your concealer products on with this side. And then right here, I use my bronzer on this side. And then on this side, I put my foundation. Uh, you can also highlight with this side if you like to do the highlight and the contour or whatnot. But I love all those different um, sides on this beauty beauty blender. And it's only 97 cents. I think this is LA Colors too. I think it's LA Colors. I'm not sure. But I think it is. I love that product. It is one of my favorites. And oh yeah, the eyeshadow that I have on right now is these right here. They are so fancy and so cute. Look at this. I use this color right here, which is this. It's supposed to be the bronzer shade. This is too grayish, like tone brown. For me, as far as putting it on to bronze, but this is very pretty as an eyeshadow. So I put this on today, and then I used this golden champagne color on my lid, and that's what I have on as a natural but shimmer type of sparkly um, eyeshadow look. So I haven't used these two tones yet. They're more matte like. They like concealer. One is a concealer. One is a, like a pearl type of shade uh, highlighter. We'll see. But anyways, you guys, I got those. And then um, one of the one of my favorite foundations. I had to go and and I actually. I had to go and purchase. I haven't opened it up. I don't think I'm going to take it back. I love this to blend in with my Dermatology Universal Tinted Moisturizer. When I want a little bit more coverage, I just put a dab of this and blend it together and put it on. And it looks so pretty. My skin looks amazing with this on. This is the NYX uh, Bear With Me Blur uh, Foundation. I get the shade Golden Light. 08. I love this. This is so pretty uh, as an everyday um, foundation. So, yeah. This is... I, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. I really, really like this. This looks so good. Okay? Love it. This is cute. And then I use the... The product that I use today is the ELF uh, Halo Glow Liquid Filter Glow Booster for Radiant Skin. I don't like this. I, I mean, my skin is drying up now, but as y'all can tell, my makeup looks like I've been working out or something like that. I mean, I had to do a few things today, but I didn't do any exercises or anything. That's the way my skin looked like as if I have... I know how my skin do when I exercise. Now, I sweat a lot, okay? When I exercise, I mean, I sweat. I be burning calories. Um, but, you know, I wasn't doing that today. And I put this on, and now I I'm just like, no. Mm -mm. But I done put it on. I can't take it back. But I wish I could, because if I could, I would take this back and get my money. But 
this right here will make your skin look so oily. The entire day, I kept looking at my face going, girl, you look like you. Like, I had to go to the doctor's office. I had to go and do something else. And then I went to TJ Maxx. And then I went to Walmart. Then I went and did something for someone that I love. Then I went to, what? Clean my car and all that. And so, that I mean, that's a good bit of things. But still, y'all, normally with my regular foundation, if I use the NYX Blur or my CoverGirl foundation, any of my foundations over here, my Beauty Creation foundation, even my Epilence foundation, I still wouldn't have been sweating so bad. But this stuff had my face looking so sweaty. Y'all look at the beginning of this video, you see what my face like look at my contour there's no contour like <laughs> y'all seeing the real deal right now well y'all done seen it anyway when i first started doing my makeup like this is the real deal okay this is my nose okay so anyways but i had a contour but the contour is gone i sweated it out <laughs> with this foundation but i do not like that at all like that is terrible i wish i could take it back but i can't um, I thought I'd give it a try. Somebody kept on asking me to try it. And I've been seeing it for a while. And I was like, nah, I ain't gonna get that. I just know if it's comparable to that flawless, flawless filter, I know I'm not gonna like it. Um, and sure enough, that is a do. It is a do. Um, so, yeah, I just thought I'd let y'all know that's a do. If y'all hear that, I'm washing a few things. I have to wash. But anyways, you guys, that I appreciate all of y'all for watching. And stay tuned for some more, I don't know. Look at me, stay tuned for more fabulous videos. That's what I was fixing to say. But honestly, y'all, I'm not doing videos anymore, okay? But every once in a while, I told y'all I would come in here and create a video, right? I told y'all that. So that I will do from time to time. Let y'all take a look at some of these products that I might purchase. Um, and, of course, if I'm... Uh, I've been going places. But I've been really busy on something that's more important. And I haven't been doing any car vlogs. Because I just... I, I couldn't record. It was just too... Just put it this way. It's too personal to, to have recorded in my car you know um shut up don't y'all just hate it that's why i need to cut off the phone but i don't turn off the phone because i'm afraid you know that you never know who might call so i don't turn it off but most of y'all do so a lot of y'all don't learn to just cut turn your phone off or turn the volume down every time i record this happens um but i'm not the only one right okay so anyways you guys yeah i mean i just haven't been recording any videos in the car simply because i've been doing a lot of personal things and i didn't feel like it would be good to record but i have a few videos that i have recorded a few weeks back so i will be uploading those videos if not if i don't upload those videos then y'all can you can you can stay tuned over here and you will see some chat videos because the chat videos is going to continue it's just i've been doing a lot of personal things and i wasn't going to actually record um you know everything so, anyways, you guys, I appreciate y'all, and that's about all I have to show y'all today. Um, I thank y'all and appreciate all of y'all, and I hope y'all understand, like, I hope y'all understand everything, and I just know that, once again, like my um, chat video. The things that I've been praying for, the Lord 
is blessing me with those things. And those are more like things that are my obligations. I have to do. I have to do what I have to do. And honestly, to say that I can create some outfits of the day videos and stuff like that, mm, not right now. Because it's a lot going on right now, okay? A lot going on. I'm talking about me, okay? It's a lot going on, and um, we'll see in time what may change, if anything changes, if God want to change this, as far as me, you know, creating YouTube and things like that. If it's meant to be, it'll change. If not, then I'm just saying don't look forward to continuous uh videos just know every once in a while i will create a video as i can okay but um car chats oh yeah you so yeah as far as car chats you'll see that from time to time but just stay tuned for real just stay tuned and just know that when i can i create a video okay i'm gonna try to get on that because I do go, I've been going off a lot, but like I said, I didn't really want to record it. Uh, I didn't want to talk because it was a lot going on. So, um, yeah, just saying, but I do want to get back to chatting so I can get back used to chatting, you know, car chats. Um, I look forward to doing that. Okay. So stay tuned and, uh, yeah, you guys, that is it. I appreciate all of y'all. Much love, care, kindness, joy, peace, and happiness. And yeah, y'all, look at me. I just got my... I'm so sorry about the clothes. I didn't feel like putting on no top. See, that's why I say I don't need to be creating no videos. Like, I literally got my, like, loungewear top. It got a hole in it. Got on my sports bra on. Yes, I didn't put on a top. I told y'all, I don't need to be creating no videos right now. <laughs> so, y'all, I am, I am in another, like, I, I, I'm thinking about things and doing things that I got to do. And I'm very, very tired. And I just love and thank God for the things that he has blessed me with. And that is what I am staying focused on or just thinking about. So, yeah, I, I just don't got time to be creating no videos. And if I do, then y'all will see something posted. You just got to turn on your notification bells. And that way you don't miss a video in case I do create an outfit of the day. Or if I decide to create a makeup look, let y'all take a look at some of these palettes. I doubt it because that's the, that's the type of makeup or that's the type not type of makeup that's the type of video that i don't like to create is the a makeup video because i take forever okay and i'm not gonna do no editing so i don't know if y'all ever see this unless y'all just happen to see it if i create a video or outfit of the day or if i decide to do a chat video in the car or something you'll probably see it then but as far as me creating a video i'm not gonna do that because it's just it's not for me okay um makeup videos is just not my thing fashion is but however right now i am focused on other things that's more important to me so yeah you guys so stay tuned and Turn on your notification bell so you do not miss a video. And I will see y'all in my next one. And much love, care, kindness, peace, and joy and happiness to everyone. And I'll see you in my next one. Take care. Bye-bye.